Hi, this is Trace HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for our November 2016 Tarot reading, and this will be for the sign of Leo. And as I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers for the highest good of all. Take a card from the top for the beginning of the month. In the middle of the month, take a card from the center. And the end of the month, we're going to take the card from the bottom. And what do we have here? Well, we start November with the hanged man, and it's a man who's suspended. You see, he's he's hanging here in this doorway. Yeah, it looks like there's like a foggy atmosphere here. And what the hanged man signifies is basically maybe changing your perspective on something. Okay, maybe looking things, looking at things from a different perspective. Now, normally the hangman on most cards is upside down. This one is right side up with his arms reaching up. Usually they're hanging by their feet. So they're kind of like turned upside down to get like a different perspective on something, literally. <laughs> and this hangman here is different. I've never seen one straight up and down like that. But what it's, what it's saying is you're going to get to like a standstill, some type of a transitional phase that you're going through in the beginning of November. And what you need to do is you just need to relax, just like the hangman, just hang in there, okay? Better things and better changes are coming. However, uh, the beginning of November is going to be a time of non-action for you. So we don't want you making any drastic changes or taking any action on anything. Um, you're going to uh, again, go through some type of transitional phase in the beginning of November. Um, you're going to kind of feel like you're at a standstill, but believe me, sometimes when we feel like we're at a standstill and nothing's happening and there's no progress being made, sometimes there is progress being made behind the scenes that we just can't see. So whatever's going on in the beginning of November, just relax, hang in there, let whatever changes are going to enter into your life you know, happen and take place. And, you know, try to just relax. Um, and, and I know it's hard, you know, when you're in a period of non-action because a lot of us want to make things happen. But it's best in the beginning of November to just, like I said, maybe take some time off, some time out, uh, hang in there, relax, enjoy the moment of non-action because our lives are so busy. I mean, there's just never enough time in the day to get everything done. Um, so this is probably a welcome change from the hectic, you know, pace that maybe your life has been. So just like the hangman, relax and allow the changes to come about. Because in the middle of the month, we have the two of wands and it's a beautiful woman. Uh, and there's two wands on both sides of her. And you see the sun in the background. And when I look at this cup or this cup... <laughs> When I look at this card, what I'm getting uh, from spirit here is there's some type of a choice that needs to be made, a serious choice, nothing that's, you know, frivolous or unimportant, a serious, serious choice needs to be made about something. So maybe in the beginning of the month, we're taking a time out here like the hangman and trying to look at the situation, whether it be a job related situation, a friendship or a romantic relationship. Okay, we're taking the time to try to look at it from a different perspective and, you know, we're not taking any action in the beginning of the month, but by the middle of the month, some action has to be taken. Okay, some choice needs to be made and maybe you have a choice to, you know, decide what path you want to go down and you just can't seem to decide. You're feeling confused in the middle of the month. You're feeling like maybe you're under pressure to make this decision. Um, so basically think about what it is that you need to maybe remove from your life, okay, to make room for something better to enter, but it's some type of a transition, some type of major changes are going on here in November, again, possibly with maybe a career or a relationship. Um, and then by the end of the month, we have the King of Swords, and he's a very serious man. And this could represent you, how you're feeling, or it could just be the energy around you. And I don't uh, look at it as gender specific. If you're a woman watching this, you could be a woman who has the energy of the King of Swords. Or if you're a man, you could very well have this male energy as well. But when I look at the King of Swords, the first thing I notice is a very serious look on his face. 
this person could, uh, he, he's a very competitive person, okay? And he sets out to win battles. He's not a wishy-washy kind of guy. He's not emotional. He's pretty strict. He has a lot of knowledge. He's lived. He's an authority figure. He would be a leader. He would not be a follower. He's definitely a leader. So his his basic, how could I say, he's he's the kind of person that's an authority figure that gets the job done. So maybe by the end of the month, you're rolling up your sleeves and you're going after whatever it is that you want because you've made the decision here in the middle of the month. After hanging out and not taking any action the beginning of the month, you're all ready for action towards the end of the month. And uh, this person here is, you know, he, he turns his knowledge into action. He's not the kind that just sits around and lets other people, you know, start things. He's a go-getter. He's very aggressive. Let's put it that way. Um, so basically, I think this month is going to turn out very, very interesting for you. Um, after a transition period and, and being at a standstill, things are going to start to pick up in the middle of the month here. You're going to make a decision. And you're going to be making a well-informed decision, I'm sure. And by the end of the month, whatever it is, whether it be a job, a career, friendship, romantic relationship, you're ready to take action. So bide your time in the beginning of the month and, and, and rest up because it looks like it's going to be very active towards the end of the month for you. And very successful as well because this guy succeeds. He succeeds. If you've enjoyed this reading, please subscribe to my channel because I'll be back.